And we're back, and once again, I forgot to exit the game while I was talking on the phone, so let's go out here and see what has come along while we were waiting. This water is getting... Ah! I knew that would happen. Knew that would happen. All right. This water has really got to go. Okay. And over here we have more... More lava. I hear zombies. I don't see anything. Yeah, I think we're either in a very big cave system or we're part of that ravine. But hey, look. Lots and lots of... Uh, of iron. And I might be nice and mine up some of this... Uh, redstone as well. It's never know when somebody wants to make a massive redstone. Hello. Hello. <laughs> Look at that. We have diamonds. We also have a gravel trap of some sort up there. And the percolating lava sound is really starting to annoy me. All right, come on. Let's clear all this out so we can see what's underneath. Our first diamond on this server since the reset. One, two. Uh, I was hoping for at least three for a diamond pick. And I suppose I could continue with the iron pick. How much coal do I have? 29. We're not going to bother with coal. I can continue with the iron pick, especially if I keep getting uh, nice uh, deposits of iron like this here. And I suppose I could just make me a diamond sword. I don't need lapis, but hey, let's go ahead and pick it up while we're here. I guess a diamond sword would be okay, but really would have liked a diamond pick. And they've corrected some things in the multiplayer, I hear, but I'm sorry to hear, sorry to uh, see that when you, uh, oh, looks like Steven has left the game. No, Steven has joined the game. Well, never mind. Probably lag or something. Oops. Let's get real close here and so we can pick up most of those. Okay, not going that way any further. Let's see here. I'm sure it'd be perfectly safe to uh, try to climb up in here with this water. I mean, what's the worst that can happen? Come on, come on, come on. Climbing up in the water. water. There we go. Okay, on the phone was one of my flesh and blood nephews. He is off getting a new uh, radio in his car. Because the old one has a removable faceplate that removes itself every time you push a button. Do you know any good ways to build a moss spawner that can get gunpowder? Not yet. I'm working on some ideas. Okay, and this would be that other ravine that we saw that we said we weren't going to explore just yet. Come on, up, over, there we go. Come on, show me the diamonds. Show me the diamonds. And that's pretty much the end of that. Lots of gravel up there, I think. Of course, somebody will show me a snapshot from this video that says, no, it was all iron. Alrighty, I think I can get around over here. Very carefully pick up this iron. Because lava can sometimes burn you through a corner. Or at least it used to could. And end of here. Okay. Good, good, good. We've explored here. There. We probably need to explore over there, but it's not easy to get to. We will ride the uh, water down here and see where it takes us. Dang, and aside from them, two diamonds. I've not seen any. Oops. Why did I just put a torch there right above the lava? <laughs> and then lose my torch. Okay, we'll leave that iron there. We have zombies nearby. 
I wonder if it's a spawner. I have not seen a dungeon in this uh, world yet since we reset. But then I haven't explored very much, have I? Been kind of a homebody hanging around the home base. Hello, Mr. Skeleton. Ow. Okay. How to take him out. One shot. Two shots. Oh, goody. Okay. Scared, scared, scared. We'll just do this then. Easy does it. There we go. He must have taken damage earlier. Because um, I think it takes more than two shots to uh, to take out a uh, mob with an unenchanted bow. Ooh, red mushrooms. grab all these because I have several uh, brown mushrooms at the house and uh, between the two you can make mushroom stew and I think I just heard an explosion so Stephen may still be uh, mining with TNT dang it where are all these zombies are they up ahead somewhere up above I mean Oops, there's one. All right, where'd you come from? Man, dang it. I wonder if I can uh, define one of my extra mouse buttons as a... Uh... Oops, apparently not. Okay. Maybe they're up there. But when I come back over here, I'm hearing them like they're really close. But we went around here. Right. That's where we found the mushrooms. How many mushrooms did I get? Five. Good, good, good. So. Hello, Mr. Creeper. Maybe I can get. If I go over here, I can find some of these mobs. Starting to annoy me with all these noises. Anything behind all this gravel? Why, well, I believe there is. He sees my name. I may be close. I heard explosion earlier. Heard explosion again. And <laughs> dug all the way over here to find that this went nowhere. Okay. And like I know what East is. Do you see any nameplates anywhere? I don't see any nameplates anywhere. Let's just go back to uh, trying to explore here and trying not to die. Alrighty. Okay, there's a zombie. Yeah, they're coming from up here in this ravine. So, where did I come into this at? Right over here. And I left me a way out. Yay. Okay. Eeny, meeny, miny, mo. Which direction do we go? And we're going to go over here. And my headphone phone just popped and scared me. Because I thought something was coming to get me. Clank. Alright. Luckily we found enough iron that I don't feel bad about wasting... Uh, Wasting them just digging plain old cobble here. He says, he lost my nameplate, and I said, because I moved away from the kabooms. Good idea, lol. Hello, another little... Hmm. Not sure what this is, but it sure is a little. Okay, and... Continuing on, we're walking, and we're walking, and... This is a big ravine. Okay, I don't see any diamond down there. 
Not sure I would see it from this high up or not. Hmm. Interesting, if you're shifting on a ladder, it slows down how fast you can mine with a pickaxe, but if you shift while you're standing, apparently it doesn't. Ooh, spooky cave noises. Almost as if there's darkness near us. Alrighty, we got some lava up here. You know, I was hoping to completely explore this cavern on this in this episode, but I don't think I'm going to. Ravine, rather. Hello, Mr. Creeper. How you doing today? It looks like there's a hole in the ravine floor, and it goes down even lower. I think I'm going to check that out. Using the old water expressway trick. Make sure the water goes all the way down, and then you pick it back up and just jump into it. Easy way down, no way back up. And now the monsters start coming. Okay. Oh, look. We got more caves. Looks like there's a skeleton down there not paying me any attention. Alright, can I make me some more torches without dying a horrible death? Let's find out. I thought, well, when I get, as soon as I get down there, I'll make some more torches, but... <laughs> Alright, redstone, iron. Looking for di diamond. I just saw diamond. Down here where the skeleton was, wasn't it? And huh, apparently a... Oops. Oh, goody. The skeleton shot the spider. You two just uh, work this out amongst yourselves. Yeah. They did, unfortunately. Alright, you stay over there. Ha ha ha. Alright, several diamonds. And some more gold and some more coal. We're good, good, good. Alrighty, this water here concerns me. Because I just know my diamond is going to fall over there and get washed off into the lava. Alright, tell you what we're going to do. Beep. Solve that problem. Oops, a little glitchy. Alrighty, one diamond. Two diamond. Oh good, we got more, we got more. Good, good, good. Three diamonds. So now I have enough diamond. I have five. I have four, enough diamond for a diamond pickaxe and a diamond sword. I am happy. We are going to call that mission accomplished. We've met our goal, whatever that goal was. Let's get us a little more gold here. A few of these coal because we're running low. And then we might start heading back up to the surface. And yes, I see the skeleton up there. But I did not notice the creeper sneaking up on me. <laughs> Golden apple time. And I know I'm kind of wasting these, but... Well, hello. Mr. Glitchy Cheating Skeleton. Well, I did kind of waste that golden apple, but if I hadn't, uh, I would be dead right now. But if somebody wants to make a mod that increases that uh, golden apple regeneration time to like 10 seconds or something instead of just 4, uh, I might install that mod for you, just so you know. I'll do a review of that mod for you. I did a review of the uh, World Downloader mod, which uh, currently doesn't work because they changed the way that the uh, world is created. Oh, no you don't. There you go. And uh, I was afraid the guy who uh, made the mod might not like my review of it, but he liked it so much he actually made it the official uh, video for the mod. 
So, I was real proud of myself for that. Okay, it looks like... Oh! Abandoned, uh... Mineshaft. I don't think I've seen one of these since the newest, uh... Version. So, that might be worth checking out. And it might not, I don't know. Let's see, more lapis, more stiff. Well, dang it, I did say I was going to, uh... Going to try to head back up, up to, uh... Up to the surface. But, like I said, I've not checked out one of these abandoned mine shafts. And it looks like they've added extra uh, wood to the floors. Or ravine there. So we've got wood floors here. Goodbye water. Hello, Mr. Creeper. And I just glitched right through him, didn't I? I suppose it wouldn't hurt to pick up a few rails while we're at it. Oh, and apparently there's a skeleton right over there. Poor skeleton who couldn't get out of the uh, webs here. <laughs> and of course, as soon as I make fun of the skeleton for getting caught in the web, I get caught in the web. I see something glowing back here. Oh, it's just gold. And some iron. Alrighty. It's been a while since I've done this, but... Doomp. Oops, that didn't work. Alright, I want to place a block there. And there. There we go. It has been a while since I've done this, but... We need to make us a... Crafting table? Apparently, with the latest uh, revision, all of our uh, achievements were reset. And make us a few furnaces. Okay, now. Let's smelt all this iron, and uh, that way we can uh, make us some extra iron armor. And then, once we have a complete set of iron armor, we will uh, go ahead and see if we can't conquer this uh, abandoned mine shaft here. And uh, mm, I don't really have a whole lot of storage space. I was about to say, I might go ahead and make me an iron sword and an iron pick, or not an iron, diamond, diamond sword and diamond pick. But instead, I think I will hold off until one of these uh, breaks. Because I'm just kind of running short on inventory space since I like to pick up everything and keep everything. Alrighty, I think I'm going to end the episode here. Uh, well, actually, I'm going to end recording here. I'll probably find out once again this is nowhere near the middle or the end of an episode. It's right in the middle. So I will fade to black and then come back right here. Uh, but just in case this is the end of the episode, this is Uncle Troy thanking you very much for joining us. Uh, please hit the like button if you like this. Uh, leave me a comment if you like something or want and want to see more of it or if you want to see less of it. Uh, give me a call. And in the meantime, please have a good night.